If you do a lot of writing and you make a lot of mistakes like me, you need these mechanical pencils. But I found out that this is the best right here. This Bix right here, these are great. They write smooth and it's, you see it's 0.9 millimeters of an inch. The outside diameter of that uh, lead is 0.9 millimeters. And that is 35 thousandths of an inch. So it's very small and you have the 0.7 millimeters and that's 28 thousandths of an inch. So you're looking at seven thousandths of an inch difference. And you may not think it's a difference, but it is a difference. This 0.7, it breaks really easy. If you like me, I put a lot of pressure on it. And this 0.9, it writes, this right here is a 0.9 millimeters. You see right there? And this thing works great. If I'm writing, it writes real smooth and it erase really good. So you can erase and I do a lot of erasing cause I have to write down a lot of numbers, especially when I'm doing inspection. So we got heat numbers, joint numbers, you got X-ray numbers. So sometimes those numbers are 10, 11 digits long. You may accidentally put an extra zero or something at the end. So this uh, mechanical pencil is the way to go. This one writes smooth. And let me show you something else about this. You know, you see this lead. Only thing you have to do is you push it and you see the lead, it comes out. And if you want to completely take this out, you can just push that and you can pull this lead out. And the good thing about this, it got two more in there. You can shake it and just start pushing it and it'll start coming out. So you just push this and pull it out. And I'm gonna show you something else. It's one more in here. But what you can do to get to the lead, I thought you had to pull this whole thing off. I done broke a couple of them, but what you wanna do is take the eraser out. And this is how you load it. You pull the eraser off and there you go, that lead. So you see that hole in there? So you can load this up with two, three, four. You could buy extra lead. So I'm gonna put these back in. Like I said, the 0.9 millimeters is the way to go. And then once you put the lead back in, you just put this eraser back on, you can push it in. And then to get the lead to come out, you just, and you probably wanna hold it upside down. You see how that lead, and there you go. So if it breaks, you just push it and get more. So this is the pen, the pencil to get if you're doing a lot of writing in the field, it's the Bix 0.9 millimeters. Don't get the 0.7, get the 0.9. It writes a lot smoother. All right, thanks for watching.